Hey everyone, Tech with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to update the software on your iPad in two different ways. So let's get started. Now, first and the easiest way to do it is if you have a Wi Fi connection or cellular data, you can actually update your iPad over the air basically without having any other uh, device. Simply go into your setting of your iPad, make sure you're connected to either Wi Fi or if you have cellular one, have your cellular data turned on. Wi Fi is going to work the best. From there on, you go to general, and then you see their software update, and it's going to look for a software update. And if you see a software update, it's going to show up here, and you're going to go ahead and download and install that software update just like that. When you do update, your iPad needs to be at least 50% or more charged if it's not connected to a charger while it's doing the software update. Now, moving on to the second method, we're going to need a computer to do that. If the update doesn't show up here for you and you know there's a software update for your iPad, we're going to show you how to do that. All right, for the second method, we're going to use our MacBook. This is one of the newer MacBooks, but if you have an older MacBook, you can also do the same process. So if you have a newer MacBook, it's really simple. You don't need any additional software on your iPad. All you need to do is connect your iPad. I'm going to connect it with the USB-C cable like you would be charging and then connect it to your MacBook here. And once you connect it here, the iPad, you're going to want to click on Trust. And then you see here there's an option for iPad. So you click on there, and you're going to want to go ahead and click on Trust, and it's going to trust, basically make that connection happen. And we can update it using our computer. We can set up as, set up as new device here, hit Continue. And from there on, there is the option to update it from here. We click on that update button and it's going to tell us what update is going to download and install and it will update to the latest version of it. Now this is the Finder app we have on our computer. Now if you don't have this because uh, it's not connecting because you have an older MacBook or you have a PC, you can download the iTunes app which you can get by going into, let's go ahead and show you, private browser. So we're going to go to iTunes it's another free software from Apple in order to help you download updates and fix your iPad in any scenario. You want to go ahead and download it. And the menu is going to look exactly like the one that we have here. You're going to see this menu similarly on the iTunes app and you click on update as well. You can update your iPad as well using your computer. So either again through your setting or on a computer. And I hope this video is helpful. So please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPad iPhone and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.